I try to do something I like almost every day that I wouldn't have done before. Just being able to stand on your feet on cement floor is amazing. This may sound somewhat ridiculous, but before the operation to go on, <clears throat> like to go to Costco and walk on a cement floor, I'd probably last about five to 10 minutes. That's all I could take. The back pain itself started in the 80s, and they told me it would be a considerable problem later on. The pain had become pretty persistent. Driving the sciatica going down the leg was getting bad and sleeping was problematic. Not being able to do things that you really enjoyed shapes you. Patients are excited about new technology. Paul was excited about being the first patient at Bayview Hospital to be the recipient of the combination of this imaging and robotic technology, which is the ability to get an intraoperative CT scan and marry it directly to robotic guidance so that we can get updated pictures in real time of his spine and then using a robot allow us to navigate very safely to put in new hardware. We're able to do an operation like this in a fraction of the time that it would take us usually. That's my wife and I, first day we were in California. The small victories felt really good. You can walk somewhere and it's not painful. And the victories get bigger as you improve. Things got better. All those little simple things are things you, you know, maybe you don't appreciate until you can't do them. You know, my wife and I have reached that age where you could sell the house, move someplace else, do something different. And one of the things we come back to is, I don't know if I could match the healthcare in other cities. I mean, to have Hopkins in your backyard is extremely important. So it's a comfort thing. <laughs>